I did BMX journalism and I picked up a video camera to start shooting bikes. I, as a young kid, just watched more than my fair share of TV, partly because I had two parents that worked sometimes at night, sometimes two jobs. A student came in and showed a short film he had made and it just seared right through me. I grew up in a small country town in Australia. I had to turn my parents' laundry into a dark room. And... You know, I started off as a rapper. They actually approached me in school. So they were in the film program and I was in a music program. It's like it opened up this whole world to me. It took me a long time to admit, but I wanted to be the artist. Seminal to my development because I did 17 musicals in the time that I was at Harvard. And then suddenly, bang, everything just explodes because I'm watching David Lynch. It was such a profound experience to walk into the theater one person and out another. I really reinvented myself when I went to New Zealand. I became a filmmaker. I met with one of the producers there. He said to me, this is what you need to do. And he suggested that I write a musical about black people. If I did that, I would be the best black musical writer on Broadway because there were none. It has made me wonder if it wouldn't have taken me quite so long to own wanting to be a director had there been more female directors. Because it's Robert De Niro, right? And in terms of being starstruck. So the experience of working with Tom Cruise was, you know, one of the more memorable moments. But when Jeremy Irons. <laughs> Liam Neeson. Viola Davis. Daniel Day-Lewis. Octavia Spencer. I got to work with Anthony Hopkins and Ed Harris. Johnny Depp. With George Clooney there and Juliana Margulies and it being a show that was seen by 40 million people. So I'm walking into Breaking Bad. I had a, I had a great time on Westworld. Amanda Snatch in the 30 seconds or less. The Emmy statue itself as a memory jogging mnemonic. Going and winning awards. No Way Out opened number one month was the biggest opening that Disney had ever had. That can was so amazing. We were suddenly like the talk of camp. She's a Casa Filby Emmy nominated. Influence the form of an entire genre. There is no room for failure. The you style know, is so This is the Director's Podcast with Jeff T. Thomas.